those pragmatists. Them pragmatists. Those pragmatists. Those. Use your proper pronouns. Sorry, sir. Anyway, we need, just to get started, we need a word. And the noun variety, perhaps. Banana. Banana. <laughs> it's like that ship we were on in the South Pacific. Oh, I remember, I remember, with all of the apes. Sloshing about side to side, throwing their feces, we could not contain them, though we tried. <laughs> oh my goodness, you send me on such memories. Uh, you know what? It reminds me of this book I read, Lord Jim. Have you read it? Yes. By, by, no. uh, Conrad. <laughs> Wait. Yes. Conrad, he also wrote Heart of Darkness. Indeed. About the jungles and the rivets. That's mostly what I remember, rivets. Rivets. We see here a zoo. And in all of these containers are dead frogs. <laughs> Just containers and containers of dead frogs. I had a friend once who was obsessed with frogs. Are you satisfied with the containers? I am satisfied with the containers, yes, absolutely. But I mean, I'm, I'm telling the story about my friend who was obsessed with frogs. Get off the He track. actually had a hat, a yes. tam shanter if you will, that was a frog, a facsimile of a frog, with eyes and everything bulging out of the top of it. Yes, I once saw a kid with a, a, a bit of a dew that looked like a brush from a centauri going up and down his you head. You need a mohawk. Critical. What does it have to do with those Native Americans? What we see here is a collection of spears of all different varieties, some short, some long, some pikes, some javelins meant for throwing, but various spears. It's likely that some of them might be bloody. They're all dead now. Oh. Every last one. It'll be us soon if you don't leave. You know that zoo knows you don't work like that. You could rub this frog all over your face and you would not even require a single case of points. Yes, I knew that once. No! Damn it, everything's changed now! Can't you see that? Zoonosis didn't used to kill frogs. The cats purr all night. They don't eat their food. Janice has left me. <laughs> it's all gone to shit. <laughs> I'm, I'm sorry to hear about your life, but the research must press on. These are... No. Simple creatures. Look, I want to fight the truth as much as you do. But not here, not this way. We... no. Me? I, I'm just asking you to calm down and perform a simple necropsy. Mm -hmm. Nothing more than that. Let's go back through the events. First Janice left me. And then I took a shitload of mushrooms. <laughs> <laughs> and then all the frogs died. And now they're preserved in formaldehyde and we're supposed to dissect them for biology class. A simple necropsy, as I said. This is... As you say, nothing, research must go on. This is nothing you can't do. Hey, this frog is a clown face. <laughs> You see the inside of it? It's not so bad. Looks like it says I love you in chiplets. <laughs> <laughs> you see this? This is the cloaca. It serves some multiple functions of the frog. It looks it's like a penis and a vagina at the same time. <laughs> That's remarkable insight. I was right. I'm going to record that in the notebook. <laughs> notebook? Yes, we're supposed to document every step of the process. You're writing the notebook. Well, I've... You're probably... writing about me in the notebook. Well, yes, I've noticed that you've had a remarkable amount of mushrooms. You're complaining about your girlfriend leaving you. Janice had a notebook. Well, of course she did. She's, you know, you know, in the period before us. Traps. <laughs> don't just stand there. Come release me. Jesus. I'm, I'm afraid that if I do anything, oh, it's, anything going to disrupt, it's going to disrupt the study. <laughs> the study's disrupted. I stepped in one of their traps. It's caught around my leg. Well, observe the trap. 
Yes, why are you sure if I stepped in the trap but just closed my leg again? No, 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 no. You're in the situation you're in because they set the trap there. Now think about why they set the trap there. This is obviously some sort of weaponry group. Maybe they didn't actually intend to set that trap. Maybe it's a sign of disorganization. These are things we need to know about these people. You remember the prime anthropological directive that we came here with, which is to observe and not to interfere. Well, I interfered. So can we, <laughs> I don't know, let one interference let me do another one and get my fucking foot out of this Maybe they're trying, <laughs> maybe they're trying to catch anthropologists. <laughs> maybe they're two steps ahead of us. Did you ever think about that? Now ask yourself, why would they want to catch an anthropologist? Uh, maybe they're cannibals. <laughs> <laughs> so what if they are? <laughs> I, I think it'll be really interesting. We can really do some advancement in the field and you get eaten. I think that's a documentation of that. That's not an acceptable outcome. <laughs> You'll at least get co-author credit. <laughs> okay. <laughs> well, I'm glad you came to office hours, but... Unfortunately, I must dissuade you from the field. I really just want to learn how to take bomb hits. <laughs> yes, but but I'm afraid you're much too straight up on the student. Look, 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 look. Uh, no, no, I've, no. Already, I've already planned out my major, okay? I don't really need a whole lot of input from you. I just need you to sign my major card. Um, I've got the three prerequisites in joints and beer bombs. Mm -hmm. And then after that, I've got a solid, you know, section laid out. I moved from uh, the pipe to the vaporizer to filling bongs to not spilling bong water, um, and then on to marijuana, you know, graduate courses. In <laughs> oh, I've had enough! I've had enough! Your ambition is impressive. <laughs> I've changed my mind. You can take this major if only you pursue your already accelerated course of study. If you can make a heroin addiction by spring semester, I think we can take you. I think that's, I, you know what, I'm actually ahead of you on that. <laughs> a little freaked out by the microscope. Well, I am too, but you know, life on the dish, what are you going to do, right? Right. <laughs> sit here and slowly divide. Well, the other day I was in the shower, and what comes through the window? 24X lens. Right in. Oh, uh, jeez. No. Yeah, right through the window. Have some consideration, okay? Really? Oh. Um, We've got to get out of here. Look, our best what? chance is to infect something. Look, I, you know what? I got to admit that I kind of want to get out, but at the same time, the rent's not bad, and they keep me in media. Shh. I've got a secret. Uh -huh. A man told me once, generations and generations and generations ago, mm -hmm. we came from another living thing, living in it. Yeah. Some say that they saw a giant finger just generations ago. So to get out of here, man. The only thing I've seen through that lens is really it's tiny eyes. the lens, man. The lens is an illusion. <laughs> the finger's the ticket. Fall on it. Maybe he's a fingernail biter, huh? Maybe he's a nose picker, even better. Maybe he's got a girlfriend. <laughs> Dude. There could be 30 of you in a generation. A thousand and two! I a never trillion pegged. and three. I never pegged you for a religious nut, but... Hey, religious nut? It is our job to multiply, to spread, to infect. Think of your children, man. Don't be a bacterial nihilist. <laughs> 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 <laughs>